A stool is a raised seat commonly supported by three or four legs, but with neither armrest nor a back or a backrest in early stools, and typically built to accommodate one occupant. As some of the earliest forms of seat, stools are generally distinguished from chairs and sometimes called backless chairs, despite how some modern stools have backrests. In modern times, the term stool has become blurred and many types now have backs. These are particularly common among bar stools, which are tall stools for sitting at a counter, often fixed in place. These are a development of the chair as much as the stool, made more compact to allow dense sitting around a serving table or counter. They may even be referred to as backless chairs. Stools are interesting types of seats that both save space and add flavor. They come in a multitude of choices ranging from color selection to frame type. Frame type is one of the most important selections a stool owner can make and there are two basic choices, wooden and metal. Metal but stools are used heavily by those seeking a more contemporary look for their homes while wooden frames add a more unique and older feel. Hello, hello, dear viewers. Welcome back to our channel. Today we have brought to you modern metal stool design ideas for your inspiration. You can use these designs to try to make your own pieces at home. So we advise you to watch the video until the end to never miss a thing and choose an inspiring design for your next project. You can even turn these plans or designs into a lucrative small-scale manufacturing business with a small initial investment on basic tools and materials. If you are new to the channel and if you like what you see, please consider subscribing to our channel and smash the notification bell so that you will be the first one to be notified when we upload new videos. It takes a lot of time and effort to make these videos. Your subscriptions, likes and shares are what inspire us to create more content. Therefore, please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already. For already a subscribed member, please like and share this video so that it could reach a wide range of audience. The origins of stools are obscure but they are known to be one of the earliest forms of wooden furniture. The defaults were the four-legged stool in ancient Greece, available in both fixed and folding versions. In the medieval period, sitting consisted of bench stools and the very rare examples of throne-like chairs as an indication of status. The simplest stool was like the windsor chair, a solid plank seat had three legs set into it with round mortise and tenon joints. These simple stools probably used the green wood working technique of setting already dried legs into a steel green seat. As the seat dries and shrinks, the joints are held tight. These legs were originally formed by shaving down from a simple branch or pole. Later examples developed turned shapes. The back stool represents an intermediate step between the development of the stool and the chair. A simple three-leg turned stool would have its rear leg extended outwards and a crossways pad attached. Back stools were always three-legged with a central rear leg. Turned back stools led in turn to the development of the three-leg turned chair, where the back rest was widened and supported by diagonal spindles leading down to extensions of the front legs. In time, these diagonal supports became larger, higher and more level, leading to the turned armchair design. There are many different types of construction materials and models of stools. They are often made of wood or metal. There are stools with and without armrests, backs, and padding or upholstery on the seat surface. 
These tools can range from basic designs to more complex ones with adjustable height. Extra tall and extra short are common features, as well as indoor stools and outdoor stools. Some stools have backs while most don't. In commercial settings, swivel and floor mounted stools are common. Floor mounting renders the stool immovable so it cannot be stolen or used as a weapon in a fight. Floor mounted stools generally are mounted on a column, but stools with legs can also be secured to the floor using metal brackets. Metal stools come in a variety of appearances including but not limited to wrought iron in black and white, steel in black and silver tones as well as aluminum in black and silver tones. Metal stools will stand the test of time and when cared for properly will last for years. Rusting is always a concern for an outdoor application and if covered properly, rust should not be an issue. There are products available for rust proofing the legs of your metal stools that come in spray forms and brush on forms. Regarding sitting materials, cushions come in a variety of colors and almost every color in the rainbow. But the most popular colors include black, red and brown. The materials used to create the cushions of your stools include cotton and foam interiors, and fox leather or plastic being the most popular exterior. These options are the least expensive and still contribute a long enough lifespan to be worth the money you pay. The more expensive exteriors include leather and silk. Although silk is not common, it is quite often used in areas with an Asian theme. These do not have a long life expectancy due to the wear and tear that stools normally get on the cushions. Leather is the most expensive and can be made with as little or as much flair as you can imagine. Button tufted designs or even needle point designs have been popular over the past few years for country and western teams. Most consumer-driven stools and nightclubs, bars and nightclubs equip themselves with metal bar stools because they tend to hold up better to drinks being spilled on them. Wooden bar stools are treated, but if too much moisture is introduced to the finish, it will cause discoloration and undo wear. Metal bar stools therefore are more popular. Well, the views, 
As you can see in the video, we have compiled a number of interesting modern metal steel design ideas for you in inspiration. Which one is your favorite and why? Let us know in the comment section. By now you know that our channel is full of inspiring videos which you can use in your projects from time to time. If you like our content, please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already and also smash the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified when we upload new videos. It takes a lot of time and effort to make these videos. Your subscriptions, likes and shares are what inspire us to create more content. Therefore, please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already. Finally, thank you for watching until the end. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Until then, stay safe and stay blessed.